mimi afadhali nikikosa kitu nikuje nikwambie mahagi by the way mimi sijakula kitu jana mm. chenye utaenda kuongea ni shauri yako mm. nikakuja kwa alta mm. so i cried kabisa ile mm. nimelala ile nikalia like three hours mm. so bishop yeye akaniita akanimsa mimi sio na boyfriend i sang until i felt like i'm about to faint in a gig a big gig watu walitolewa kapelekwa uh, sapa mm. uh, mimi nikabaki you cannot lead when you are bleeding mm. wakupewa sifa na utukufu ni wewe Mungu wakuabudiwa wakuabudiwa wakuheshimiwa ni wewe Mungu wakupewa sifa wakupewa sifa na utukufu ni wewe Mungu Mungu mwenye nguvu Mungu mwenye nguvu wasahili wasahili heshima zote yeye kama wewe hakuna mwingine wakulinganishwa na wewe Welcome to the Music Stories Discussion Edition. Yes. Hey, today we have who in studio on my right. <laughs> <laughs> Introduce yourself. My name is Prince Shafini Letter. Mm. I'm born again Jesus is Lord. Hey, and today we have the beautiful, amazing, anointed Gloria and Alisa Belinda. Hey. Lord, That's and then name. we have our very own, <laughs> our very own <laughs> MC Barack Mwenyewe. Hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. MC Wabalu, <laughs> this guy na looks <laughs> his designer we are sorry. Please usimshone ngote na usemwe tusumbua kama ma MC. Hey. Yeah. Karibu uh-huh. sana. It's good to have you. Asante. Thank you. Thank you for honoring the invite. Mm. I'm the invitation. At least it's okay to talk about the bahasha. You know where this discussion is going. Yeah. You know where it's headed. Uh-huh. And we are just here to love on one another. Yeah, yes. sure. And I'm your girl Maggie Joy Blessings. And today we want to talk about the things that no one wants to talk about. Very true. And I've been handling issues. Mm-hmm. The past one week there is a, a minister okay. in an altar. And by Eh hey, they are, they've been going through something. Amekuwa ananiambia haja kula. Amelala njaa, nyumba inaenda kufungwa. Those are the things I want us to talk about. Mm-hmm. Uh, there is pain in service. Mm-hmm. What do you think we are not doing as ministers? Kitambo ukiwa na njaa you would go ama <laughs> ugegevi church pasi anakuangalia hivi anasema magi utakula. Mm-hmm. Anakusort. Mm-hmm. Ni nini ili change what's happening? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, what I can say mm. people are going through difficult issues yes. and uh, people are, are in different seasons in life. Yes. Mm-hmm. And uh, now we are talking about ministers. Yes. The altar ministers. Yes. yes. These include singers, pastors, uh, mm-hmm. people who are serving yes. who are serving on the altar. Yes. And uh, you find that most of most people tuna tunaogopa to speak out mm-hmm. because uh, i might be thinking if i tell gloria mm-hmm. what is happening mm-hmm. i'll be topic of discussion mm-hmm. some people are fearing to speak out because it's like you are giving people the topic mm-hmm. of what to say watu wanataka kusema unamwona atafanya naimba pale akilia sio uwepo wa mungu ni kumna unamshuhudia ni matatizo yako naye so some some people decides wacha tunyama wacha ni nyamazie ni deal tuna mungu peke yake of which that one ina wakati tuna nyamazia you are the one who suffering the people you are the people that you are fearing to talk to 
hakuna kitu hakuna wata, kitu wata, wata lose Alaki but wewe ndio utajiumiza mm. and uh, there is a there is a thing that say uh, mm. you cannot lead when you are bleeding mm. you cannot lead when you are bleeding mimi afadhali nikikosa kitu nikuje nikwambie mahadi by the way mimi mm. sijakula kitu jana mm. chenye utaenda kuongea ni shauri yako but, but i've spoken my mind hata kama utanisaidia lakini uende uniseme Yeah. Na so, the problem ambayo tuko nayo kwa church mm. sana sana kwa church mm. and the not just in church mm. the servants mm. tunaogopa ku speak out mm. because of what people will say yes. na hiyo inafanya tunateseka mm. and uh, i think tunastahili tu tufike that one also brings that uh, relationship yako na watu iko na maana because sometimes pia it depends because pia wewe zienda tu ukimwagia kila mtu matatizo Bashi yako bezaki. lazima ujue ni nani utaambia mm. na lakini sasa shida inakuanga ni relationship na the people that you deal with. Eh dada Gloria, yeah. tueleze. Have you ever found yourself in such a situation like you're supposed to serve on Sunday na tumbo. Haina chochote. Na kuja fast. You know very well you're not fast. Yes. Yes. It has happened mm. not once not twice. Eh unajikuta uko kwa hiyo hali ya kwamba umeishiwa kabisa. Mm. Ukiangalia like uh, left right and center mm-hmm. ni Mungu tu hey, hata jovi imeisha <laughs> <laughs> na sasa unaenda kwa anga sometimes yes. kuna macho zingine tunabia mm. sio hoshi si <laughs> sio uguso ni mapito lakini kwa hayo mapito bado yes. bado Mungu yuko tu mm. bado watu kwenye kiti cha enzi mm. lakini kile kiko ni kwamba tumekosa wa kuongea naye mm. yeah. tumekosa wa kuzungumza naye mm unakuta like for example mimi nimewacha nijisemea you as a person there's a time nilikuwa church mm. mm. sijahama church sana pastor wangu ni mmoja for the last 20 something years eh mm. alikuwa pastor huko tukahama na mm. mm. so ndio mimi nilitoka before eh mm. uh, bishop akanita kwa office mm. akaniuliza asante moja because kuna siku nilipitia ka issue mm. nikakuja kwa altar mm. so i cried kabisa ile mm. nimelala ile nikalia like 3 hours mm. so bishop yeye yeah, akaniita akaniuliza kwa <laughs> 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 Gloria tuongoze kwa ibada. Mm. Ni kwa hapo. Mimi nina break si kwa sababu ya Bwana, hapana. Mm. No. Ni kwa sababu kuna staffs zingine zenye mm. Bwana is just yes. So kuna, kuna, kuna hiyo disconnect. Mimi sasa huyo ni baba mm. badala kuulize. Kwa e. upole. Na ama ama ashaba. Yashamaliza. Mm. Ni boyfriend. Nikuacha. Mm. Lord. Wait, Father Lord. <laughs> Back to you studio. Yes. My brother. <laughs> Isaac Barak have you ever found yourself in such a scenario like you're serving uh-huh. but una uchungu mm. for me personally mm. uh, uh, I, i wouldn't say I'm, i'm i've been very long in the industry mm-hmm. yes but uh, the few years in the kwa industry i would say maybe dynamics are how the church mm. was operating mm. back then is totally different. different kitambo church was more of family home you would no mama nani mm. mama flani mama flani mm. and people would uh, have time mm. even to do home fellowship yes. in a more intimate way yes. such that zili kwa zina happen kwa nyumba zetu mm. mtu mna invite watu wanakuja by the time mm. tunakuja tunapata bibi hamjaasha ta mm. tunajua bibi hakuna mafuta ya yeah. uh, unaona yes, so yes. we as a church <coughs> as a community as a fellowship mm. we can be able to help yeah but sai mm. uh, other story na home fellowships uh, kidogo uh, zimepungua mm. so it makes it i would say it's also it's kind of like two way mm. uh, you would not understand because sasa without the fellowships even the pastor mm. being able to get information that maybe a particular person in the church mm. is going through a particular season mm-hmm inakuwa hard. Mm-hmm. So I would say these are dynamics in a matter a lot mm-hmm. uh, but apart from that mm-hmm. I believe uh, there are some things which can be done mm-hmm. to be able to help 
people, people. who might not have, mm -hmm. uh, who, who might not be able to have at least food in yeah. the house mm -hmm. or something of the sort. Because akuna, I would say akuna maybe strategies ama plans in kwa kusaidia such people. Mm -hmm. Ama maybe um, uh, during COVID, mm -hmm. for example, mm -hmm. kuta, many people were really fired. Yeah. Watu wakwa job. Mm -hmm. But most of the people wakwa na ata where to take uh, maybe I'm going through this particular season. Mm. Who do I talk to? Who do I talk to? Who do I talk to? Because most churches were actually locked at that time, yeah. at that point. So not a kuta, many people backslid during mm. that time. <laughs> now na zakuta maybe mm. ni, maybe they went through a very rough time. Rough time. Na mtu mm. So we need structures in churches right mm. now mm. where people can be able to talk. Mm. Kama ni counselors wataekwa, mm. kama ni uh, leaders wataekwa, mm. kama ni fellowships zitakuwa revived, mm. ndiyo watu waeze kusaidika. Mm. Mm. Isikue, huku um, inje tunahangaika, but there is no one we can talk to even mm. inside the church. Mm. I'm really hoping mm. that even as after this conversation, yes. structures will be set, set that can be able to help ministers mm. and also church members, <coughs> ndiyo tuweze kusaidika. Mm. Yes. You mm -hmm. as a person, have you ever been wounded mm -hmm. in church? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> or uh, in service? In yeah. service. Or in with church. a fellow minister? Mm -hmm. Um, his <laughs> uh, story is personal. <laughs> I know. It's very, very personal. Uh -huh. But I have also been wounded. Yes. I, have, I have served. I remember uh, at one point I, I, I used to be a BGV yes. for quite an, a number of music ministers. Yes at that point mm -hmm. and i remember one one gig we had planned in town mm -hmm. and it CBD. was amazing mm -hmm. cbd pale nairobi mm -hmm. to me chapa practice yes. ilikuwa bado campus mm -hmm. uh to me fanya kila kitu yes. we are ready for the event mm -hmm. we are told you just avail yourself yes food is provided yes. kila kitu iko provided mm -hmm. i was staying alone mm -hmm. so when she natoka nyumbani najua food iko sorted so chafu jambo home napika Afanga, mimi ni nabeba mwoko kwa babi, niende kwenye venue, mm. tufanya gig. Yes. I had not eaten breakfast, yes. I had not eaten lunch. I knew at least supper I'm going to eat. <laughs> <laughs> Shoko <Shocker> you. <laughs> you. <laughs> Itima. Yes. Oh, I Lord. sang until I felt like I'm about to faint in a gig, a big gig. Watu walitolewa kapele kwa uh, sapa, mm, uh, mimi ni kabaki. Uliko uh, kule nene. Na I thought I was actually not going to sing yeah. until I was called. Mm. So when I was called, I had to. Mm. In it was, I had committed myself. Yeah. I was actually the only tenor. Mm. I sang, but mm. uh, it was hard. And it was hard. Mm. Uh, and I can't, see, yeah, and how, that is the last time mm. I, yes. I went to an event. Mm like that to BGV. Actually, Niliata could be GV. It discouraged you from... It killed my esteem. It, mm. it derailed me. I felt so discouraged. Mm. But uh, God is still faithful. Mm. We are still serving. Mm. Yeah. But not in BGV. But not as a BGV. So, I know. That I brings me to my next question. You see him, he was born again. Mm -hmm. He loves God and all that. So imagine such a thing happening to a new believer. Mm. Somebody who just received Christ, what do you think would happen? Madam Gloria. And as a Kubali, we are sweet to tell you. Yes, we are Matthias. Yes, when I thought Naja, me when you never talk, I yes, well, he said, My yes, we are not here, and I will end him, cut it off. Yes, see, that is what the Bible says. So, we don't have to have So, Sissy, come on, do my Nini, Munafiki to Nafak fine. Nini, come on. What are we supposed to do? For us, <coughs> not to wound like him, he stopped being a BGV. I think, uh, yes, I was in a praise and worship uh, team, yes, somewhere a mm. few years back, mm. and uh, unapatiwa service when they would lead, mm. lakini uwa wakati, mm. ni najua kwamba hawa watu tuna lead na wao. Mm. There is some rumors about the litangazo hizo wakati nikiwa kwa in that town kwenye nilikuwa. Bad rumors too. Mm. Na zimetokana na praise and worship. Mm. Praise and worship members. So, si tunakuja, tuna lead. Mm. Watu wana lead, we una, una lead, bando ukilia, watu wanafikia ni wepo mungu. Mm. Kumbe, Kumbe unalia. 
unalia kwa, na hata uli sababu ya kitu kingine unalia una, una ukijua kwamba your enemy is the person mwenye yako nyuma yako hapo kwanza anakufanya yes. baka Jesus is Lord <laughs> that is the worst thing na hiyo ndio nafanyanga many people we are, we are on the altar leading mm. but you are still bleeding, bleeding. tunafikiria ni presence ya Mungu imeshuka mm. kumbe wewe uko tu na matatizo zako pale mm. so what what are we supposed to do mm. as a minister mm. I, I believe that every every ministry mm. has its structure. Yeah. <laughs> Sio? Yes. Kila ministry kuna structure yake. Mm. Kama ni praise and worship mm. kuna structure ya leadership. Yes. Na hiyo leadership inaanzia kwa the the vision bearer who is the man of God or the woman of God in that house. Mm. So inaanzia in, in fact mimi usemaye kwamba the, the the pastor mm. or the whatever the name mm. the pastor of that house yes. is the first worship leader. Mm. Sindio? Mm. So the structure inaanzia kule juu. Inasaidi kuanza na yeye, mm. anasaidi kujua hawa watu wake. Mm. Because these are these are your children. Yes. Your support. Na kama mzazi, mm. kuna wenye mtoto wako umemzoea mtoto anakuanga hivi. Mm. Lakini all of a sudden I'm a change. You are not supposed kama wenye bishop wake alimuuliza, mm. "Wewe acha na boyfriend?" <laughs> Imagine such a question. <laughs> But this is the person ambaye anasaidi kujua huyu mtoto akuange hivi. Yeah. Lazima nifuatilie nijue mm. what is not happening or mm. what is happening. Mm. But sasa na unapata kwamba from the leadership mm. kumekuwa na that gap. Kuna hiyo rift. Mm. And na hiyo ile hiyo gap ipatikane. Mm. Nini ile hapa? Ni sisi, sisi mm. ambao tuna, tuna, tunaona hiyo gap. Mm. Tulichangia nini hiyo gap ikakuwa. Pia yeah. you are supposed to you are supposed to ev- evaluate yourself ujue ya kwamba mm. mimi nami nilifanyia nini. Mm. Kwa sababu hatuwezi kuwa tunasema tunakosewa tunakosewa. Pia sisi kuna mahali ambapo tuna Mm. You are supposed to ka, to ujiita kama mkutano ujiulize mm. prince. Mm. Kwani mimi tu ndio nitakuwa nakosewa mm. hata mimi niwezekana ninakosea mtu. Doing? So what am I doing wrong? wrong yeah. And then ukishagundua what you are doing wrong mm. you rekebisha that mm. then unakuja kwa huyu mtu mm. then you sit down and hapo kutakuwa na that understanding ya kwamba at least ningekuona mm. nitakuelewa na nikujue na nitakufikia. Mm. Lakini tukiwa tumeka hizo ma boundaries mm unajiona kwamba mimi niko sawa mm. mimi tu ndio ninakosewa mimi sikosea hii mtu mm. it's very wrong the been an issue ya yeah, waimbaji wa nyimbo za injili mhm uh, sote tuko kwa huduma na msamaha i think it's the first thing mm-hmm. kwa 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 kubilia and all that mm-hmm. unapata mwimbaji amekosewa na mwimbaji mwanzake mm-hmm. alafu mwimbaji badala ya kuongea na mwimbaji mwanzake anaenda kuweka kwa mitandao ya kijamii mm-hmm. do you think that is a good thing Uh, for me as Barack mm-hmm. that is the wrongest thing you can ever do yes because uh, social media never forgets yes you will post it on facebook mm-hmm. ig mm-hmm. wherever mm-hmm. Uh, 20 years back it will still appear as a tbt imagine yes so mm-hmm. it's very wise for you to at least tone down mm-hmm. if you can kama umekosewa na mtu try and maybe uh, sort it out behind the scenes yes. yeah. instead of bringing it in the limelight mm. uh, kwa sababu hata kuileta kwenye limelight mm. saa zingine hata haiwezi solve that problem mm. the, the main thing is you solve that issue mm. issue mm. kui surface me yeah, i don't think that is the right way mm. uh, and people will know you don't forget you yeah. don't forgive yeah watu waki watu wakikuwa na hiyo perspective kuhusu na kila mtu kukosea mm. they would not allow you to eh, even interact Itaraki with them yeah. or something like that itakufungia nje mm. niki nikiunga tu chini mkono chenye anasema mm. inefficiency mm. the bible says that uh, you are allowed to be angry yes. mm. but do not allow the sun to go down come mm. down at the end of the day we are still human beings mm. na unaruhusiwa kukasirika yes. Yes my personal experience ni kwamba yes. mimi nikikosewa na mtu mm. ama nikijua kwamba nimekosewa mm. asira yangu mimi utuliza wakati nimenyamaza mm. even if what i did was wrong mm. lakini now you want to amplify it yes. sita 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 mm. most of the time i don't talk i just keep quiet mm. i allow people or you to say what you think you mm. you know, you know. nitanyamaza Nina, so mm. i don't like kujibizana na mtu mm. i keep quiet mm. why why mm. because i've learned some wisdom from that mm. anytime umekasirika utasema kitu yeah. na unajua maneno ikishatoka 
kurudisha always rudisha mm. so sometimes you have to be very careful what you are saying mm. especially when you are angry yeah and if you know your anger can cause you to harm people mm. by your words by the things that you have maybe ukikasirika mm. unachukua maji na mwagia watu you better ukido mekasirika walk away from that place mm. uh, in the, and if you know ya kwamba your words most of the time ukio mekasirika utaongea vibaya mm. just keep silent mm. Wacha kila mtu akuone ya kwamba wewe ni mpumbavu. Na hata Biblia I think the Bible inasema ya kwamba mpumbavu hata kinyamaza anaonekana kuwa mwenye hekima. Lakini atakapoongea ndio utajua akumbe mtu si mwerevu. Lakini kwa kunyamaza. Na kunyamaza sio kumaanisha kwamba at what they are saying is right. No. Or what they are saying is wrong. No. Wakati mwingine unanyamaza kwa sababu una avoid vitu vingine. So as a ukikosewa as a minister mm. or as a people in church yeah. as Christians mm. so let me say that. Uh, jua yakoomba Mungu akusaidie because we have the holy spirit inside of us yeah. and the holy spirit of god cannot lead you to do something that is wrong mm. if you kama wewe umenikosea na maybe siwezi kukufikia mm. na ninakuona ya kwamba na ni gloria mm. ni rafiki yako kana yeah. kana use, use gloria no. kwambie tafadhali yeah. enda waambie magi kuna kitu yes. alifanya Mahaki na siku fr- kwa sababu mimi ninajua nikimuongelesha sitamuongelesha vizuri yeah. but since wewe ni rafiki yake mm. nendo kamwambie kuna kitu alifanya na siku sikia mm. now gloria will be the bridge between us mm. ya kutuunganisha kama ni mtu ambaye anataka amani atatuunganisha say atakuja kuambia magi mm. na si ati akuja aongezee pia chumvi yake <laughs> jile inakuanga now the problem the problem inakuanga ni kwamba mimi nikikwambia huyu yeah. information yenye mimi nimempatia ikifika kwako inakuja mm. ikiwa tofauti so ndio so, inakuja inaongeza mambo lakini kama yeye ni, ni, ni dada ambaye anamtii Mungu mm. atakuja kwako akwambie Shafin ameniambia hivi na hivi na hivi mm. what happened mm. then you'll seek to know after you've known that mm. anaweza tutaka tukalishwe tu wote tuonge mm. then we solve this thing lakini kwenda kuandika mtu social media mm. alafu hizo comments utapata social media ndio zita solve thing. they want <laughs> yes but like, kuna wengine nao udakuze wanapenda sana hivi <laughs> kuna mtu ana screenshot kitu mm. anakuja ananiletea kwenye inbox ananiuliza what do you know about this <laughs> <laughs> Nikamwambia mm. uh, bro mm. unaniona kwenye hiyo conversation hapana haunioni mm. atafuta huyo mtu mm. muongeleshe direct. direct because sometimes people try to over even exaggerate stuff mm. Mm. something is very simple maybe it's a it's a disagreement mm. why should you look for someone else yes. rather than going directly to the person who has done the mistake yes. and ask them mm. what why have you done this Yeah. and how can we be able to solve, to solve. this problem instead, instead of, of trying to spreading huku mm. na kule malice mm. gossip kila mali mm. that does not help for me mm. i actually personally told that person mm. uh that is crap Eish. don't bring it in, in my song. inbox i don't song. do <laughs> i don't do gossip no. but that seems so when you stop it because you can call. imagine mm-hmm. for example that mimi maybe ni respond in a negative way a screenshot <laughs> at a <laughs> at <laughs> me mwingine the hate, the hate will continue to spread yeah. like wild fire mm-hmm. i love what i want to say manga bad bad news spreads mm-hmm. like fire yeah. very fast very fast now maybe something as good as what i did maybe people will not know yeah. but now that i'm talking about it people mm, will know. know let's shun talking, talking. over doing it ukiona kitu ime happen mbaya instead of uh, approaching Kusu. someone else to make it imalize eh uh, atana nayo be the full stop to that problem mm. now yes. what barakas raised up huh? brings me to my next topic you find nowadays in church mm. we have groups Do you support these two groupies and do you think these groupies maybe ndo zinafanya wase you suffer in silence groups za kuna two groupies eh yes alafu unapata kuna ule mimi siongei na glory sasa jo mimi siongei na glory shafi na fai kuongea na glory these things are happening in church have you found yourself in such kuna yeah. kuta mm. for example hata kwa present worship team yes, yes. kuna wale wako pande hii mm. na kuna wale mkisema tu buy uniform ya red mm. kuna wale wanataka ya black mm. kuna wengine wanataka ya white yes. so kuna kuwa na hiyo mm. but i think the main thing ni kwamba sisi wenye tuliingia church yes hatujui papa sisi kanisa yeah watu wengi waliacha ile culture ya ya, ya salvation yes tuliokoka kwa nini wow. why you say why you in church yes 
I always tell people, mimi uimbaji nilipata kama nilioko, nilikoka. Mm. Yeah. So hii imenifuata mm. in salvation. Mm. So I should major kabisa kwa salvation. Mm. Sure. Christ in me mm. in this situation what am I supposed to do? Sasa hii kugongana kwingi tunagongana because mm. hatujui purpose yetu. True. Mm. Hatujui tunaenda wapi mm. na hatujui tulitoka wapi. Sisi mm. tulijikuta church. Mm. Na ujui ulikuja kudu. Mm. That's why unakuta tunagongana mm. because I, I think there's a scripture somewhere ambayo inasema some things should not be mentioned mm. among us yourselves. Yeah. Kuna vitu wazifai kutajwa. Mm. Lakini siku hizi kando na kutajwa. Eh, Zinafanya. Mm. Na zimeja. Yes. I can add on that na niseme hivi. Mm. I love uh, following the scriptures. Yes. Second Chronicles chapter 5 verse 13 and 14. Mm. Inasema mm. When the musicians, the instrumentalists, and all these people, mm. they did things in unison, mm. in together in unity. Mm. The glory of God came down, yes. and the ministers could not minister mm. because of the glory of God. Mm. That's why unapata kwamba nowadays mm. mtu wame, watu wamekuja kanisani mm. wakiwa wagonjwa na wanatoka wakiwa wagonjwa. Yeah. Mm. Watu wamekuja na matatizo kanisani mm. wanatoka wakiwa na matatizo. Yes. Because of what inaanzia pale mbele kwa leadership. Mm. And I'm talking this uh, kwa sababu mimi niko kwa ministry of praise and worship. Yes. Mm. So I'm talking to others ministers. Hakuna yeah. yes. venye wakati nasema kwamba they worked together in unity. Mm. Hakuna venye mimi ninakuja nimebeba gloria ama siongeleshi gloria, gloria na tuko in the same, same altar. Mimi siongeleshi drumist kwa sababu wakati wakati niliimba wimbo fulani hakunichezea vizuri simuongeleshi. <laughs> Now I, uh, kwa sababu this leader huyu ndiye analid song mm-hmm. lakini kwa sababu la sign hapo nilidia vizuri mm-hmm. sitaki kupatiana mic mm-hmm. ninashika mic lakini nataka kuimba ni muharibie tu. Mm-hmm. Ah. How can the presence of God come? How can people be healed in the presence of God? Mm-hmm. That's why sisi ndio tuna mimi nasema kama worshipers mm. we are the people ambao tunatesa wa, tunatesa watu wa Mungu mm. because we are not uh, regardless ya kwamba tuko na presence ya Mungu ndani yes, yetu yes. there is that manifest presence of God that is supposed yes. to be manifested as yes. we worship him mm. in unison yes. in corporate worship mm. so has hizi vitu hazitafanyika wakati babo tunabebana mm. na ndani ya moyo wako una Mungu amekupatia moyo mmoja mm. utabebaje Mungu ndani ya moyo wako na ubebe mwanadamu ndani ya This heart is is for God. Mm. As you worship him we are supposed to worship him in spirit and, and in, in truth. truth. We cannot worship him in spirit and in truth tukiwa tumebebana. Ukinikosea mm. my friend tukae tu chini. Mm. Tuseme basi hata mimi sita minister mm. until we sort this thing. Mm. Kama imenishinda sisi tukiwa wili mm. tutafute mtu atatu. That's what the Bible says. Mm. Akishindi uki, uki ndugu yako na akatai mm. tafuta mwingine. Mm. Aki, akikataa tafuta ukwe wili. Akifika watatu ama wanne mm. na akatai huyo unaachana na Yesu sana mhesabu kwa Mm. Lakini kama tusipo sote hizi vitu hizi vitu tukiwa kabla tujafika kuministia watu mm. we are releasing that spirit of hate to people to people but we release the presence of God to people mm. we are releasing the spirit of hate mm. so as ministers mm. sisi ni wanadamu yes na tunaweza tunakuazika tuna tunafanyika vitu yeah. lakini wakati tunakuazika mm. tusibebe hiyo makwazo tukazileta kwa madhabahu ya Mungu mm. wakati tunahudumia watu wa Mungu tunawaachilia zile roho zetu mbaya tunaziachilia mm. watu wanaanza kulia pale mtu anafikiria eh hey, brother mm. na leo usiumelia ni uwepo wa Mungu uwepo wa Mungu hapa ndani na na bibi ni nasema kwamba watu waongo watu wengine mbinguni wao unadanganya na toko cha So, yeah, ni uwepo wa Mungu na unajua sio uwepo wa Mungu. So we really need to work on ourselves. Yes, yes. We, we need to heal mm. as persons and also humility. Yeah. We have forgotten about humility. Mm. Uh, most of us are so full of ourselves yeah. that we know we are wasanif. Yes. one gig. <laughs> Wafungi. Yes. <laughs> Kuna gig moja nilienda mm. na omusani alikuwa hapo hapo. <laughs> and a present mm. a beautiful very beautiful lady mm. a very beautiful voice yes, yes. but alikuwa anaimba bgv mm. behind eh, so sio ya na lead mm. so anaimba bgv vizuri sana mm. huko na stand kwa mic yale mm. kwa ameshika microphone mm. alafu there was another lady mm. who wanted also to sing to, sing. to help with the bgv yes. do you know what this lady did <laughs> alikuwa anamwimbi anamshikia mic hivi akiimba like aizi mpea mic kai I will hold the mic for you. You you don't know. Yeah. I am the one who knows. knows. That's why I have. Amemwekea tu hivi. In a concert. 
that's how much we are not united. Like it's a game. Yeah. <laughs> it's a game. It's no. Jesus. That is how much yes, we um, are proud. Um, that is how much. Um, and we need to come back to the place where we are at the feet of Christ. Yeah. Na hapo hakuna pride. Mm-mm. Hapo ni kwa lao God atutumie. Eh. Eh, si tume practice pamoja. Eh. When the time comes for me to give you the mic, shine. I, kindly. Eh. Mtubishe, tuimbe pamoja. It, no. is, it is not me. Uh-uh. It is not about it's, Barak. It is us. When, to when, he, when my brother here said, yeah. when the musicians sang, sang together in harmony, mm-hmm. that is when the presence so of God, God comes. Is. But ukianza <laughs> sivi, ni mimi. <laughs> so, and we can all agree that's why there is no manifestation of God's of presence, God's presence. Mm. and no man watu wanakuja na kansa wanarudi nazo and now my final question my yes. final discussion mm. so that we can finish mm. this na tutoke hapa tukiwa tuko sawa yes kitambo when you were growing up mm. kulikuwa uko nje mm. uko unasikia mama amepigwa mm-hmm. eh, bwana amefanya mama amerudi i grew up in a family kama hiyo ya vita mm. mamangu alikuwa very rough by the way na alikuwa ni anapiga mzae na ni anapiga nduru ni anapiga mzae anauma naona kabisa anauma lakini yeye ndo anapiga nduru but then my mom was not born again mm. me i would run to church huh? mm. but right now this thing this violence fighting nini it's happening in church mm. you see a sister coming akona wound ya kupigwa na nini na nini kitambo church would be like a hospital mm. for such mm. what is happening shida iko wapi mimi kama mbaba niliyeo alitaogea wewe kwanza umeoa juzi tuambie shida iko wapi ah sija sina sina experience ya ndoa sana yeah but uh, nowadays hizo cases zimekuwa mingi sana na ni kwa sababu gani es- especially to ministers yes. what are what are, yes it is happening in church yeah. but especially the ministers yes. waimbaji mm. wachungaji mm. people who are serving god yes. it happens mm. these things are happening because mm. you got married to this person mm. especially when you tumewa when you tumewa church mm. you got married to this person because aliimba vizuri akavutia moyo wako ah. ukasahau ya kwamba you are not you are not kwa nyumba muendi kufanya concert ah, ah. Mm. ama uliolewa mtu mm. kwa sababu uliolewa na huyu mtu mm. kwa sababu akipreach hey. akitetemesha so sauti karuza <laughs> now you thought this person is an angel from heaven yeah. ukasahau ya kwamba this is a human being yeah. na kila mtu huyu ni mtu ambaye alilelewa na wazazi wake mmepatana na yeye akiwa na meno yote 32 hata mm. kama amengoa zingine kama mimi <laughs> na huyu ni mtu ambaye umepatana na akiwa mtu mzima of which alikuwa na garbage zake Mm-hmm. Hata kama ameokoka mm-hmm. kulikuwa na garbage ama ama kulikuwa na kazi ambayo Mungu anamfanyia ana, ana ama Mungu bado anaendelea kumfanyia. Mm-hmm. Na kwa sababu during the wakati wa coaching ama wakati wa nini wa relationship everybody anakuanga angel. Yes. Hata uki ukicheka uki, uki na ah you are laughing like an angel. <laughs> like wewe like kwa nyumba na kwambie unachekanga aje kama mlevi. Mm-hmm. Now the true colors zinaanza yes. kutokezea. Lakini sasa mm-hmm. nilifanya harusi. Mm-hmm harusi yangu ilikuwa colorful yes people came i'm born again i'm a minister yes. and this person is beating me in the house mm. or hata kando na kunipiga ana emotional ananitesa ananifanyia mm. vitu mm-hmm. so ninaogopa ku speak out yes. ama kutoka mm. kwa sababu ninaogopa watu watasema nini then there is this scripture that we normally use god hates divorce <laughs> That's the script. Na tuna unaambiwa una ya kwamba like wazazi wetu wa kitambo ma, ma uh, guka zetu mm. walikuwa na wa, au wakiendelea walikuwa nasema ndoa ni kuvumilia. Mm. Wao walikuwa napigwa venye yeah. unasema una, una kwamba haikuanga church. Mm. Ndio hawako wanaenda church. Mm. Wanapigwa lakini anasema ndoa ni kuvumilia. And nowadays unapata kwamba wengi wanasema ninavumilia especially ladies mm. ninavumilia sababu ya watoto. Yeah ninavumilia lakini sasa jambo kubwa kwa kanisa especially mm. to ministers mm. watu watasema nini na ni church yes. na, na in other way in other way ni church ndio tumechangia mm. hizi vitu kufanyika mm. kwa sababu ama minister of the gospel yes. i sing mm. si ndio mm. lakini sasa nime divorce mke wangu yeah. definitely hamtaniita kuimba uh-uh. 
we ni divorce hakuna kitu utakuja kuambia watu mm. so ni mimi ninaogopa mm. ile matatizo ninapitia katika ndoa yangu sitafanya kwa sababu nina protect ministry mm. lakini kuliko ku protect maisha yangu mm. then wakati kitu kita happen because hata wanaume wanapigwa sio ladies mm. pekee wanapigwa so kwa sababu ninaogopa ya kwamba nikitoka nje ni speak out watu watasema na wenyewe na wenyewe ni mtumishi wa Mungu mm. una divorce nini nini so mm. i think to, kanisa ime to, to me spiritualize everything, everything. tumesahau ya kwamba there is time ambapo tunasahili ku, ku speak kwa kimwili kukua kimwili haikumaanisha kwamba umeacha Mungu Mm-mm. bado uko na Mungu yeah. and the same god who hates divorce is mm. the same god who hates violence in yeah. in marriage mm. so me i prefer to speak out mm. and the church should wana style ku create that environment where mm. i can speak mm. why 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 why, why uh, is it that some people are not speaking out mm. you will become a topic yeah na huyu akaacha bwana yeah. huyu akaacha mke mm. ama huyu hata kama mwanamwana ako hapa hivi mm. usiku anatandikwa nyumbani <laughs> so tunaogopa yeah. ku speak out yeah. of which I, I, i'll put it to the church leaders yeah. that we are supposed to create an environment uh. kuambia kwamba regardless ya kwamba umeokoka and whatever is happening mm. just speak out mm. speak out come and speak hata kama ni kuseparate wacha tu separate tu sotingi hizi vitu mm. kama huyu yako kando watu wakiwa hai lakini mkisoti vitu mtu akishakufa tukienda kuzika hata mm. hata hata ukishi huyo huyo jamaa akishikwa ama dada akishikwa mm. na, na maisha imeshaenda mm. what will happen Alafu one last nini then we we finish this we we say good night na goodbye uh, my sister gloria do you think what is happening is contributing to most singles not watamani kuolewa because of what is happening do you think pia ina, ina contribute ina contribute yeah. sababu i always ask mm. watu wa kituita harusi huwa wanapendana mm. wako in love kabisa yeah. mm-hmm. maybe siku zote huuliza what happened nini ubadiliko uko ndani mm. so it's so scary yes. kuna watu unakuta wa, ime happen vitu mm. so inaogopesha kidogo mm. Mm. fear of unknown yes there's something you don't know mm. yenye inauma watu hapo e. <laughs> so, kuna kitu kinauma <laughs> watu so unakataa kuanza kwa sababu mm. unaogopa and then mm. unaanza kuona to red flags mm. mapema tu mm. hata hatu you create you create mm. something mm. but me bado narudi pale pa kusema mm. hapo wakati tuliokoka mm. mm uwe kwa real kwa salvation yes. you know we fake a lot we mm. fake too much mm. yeah. so if fakeness ndio inakuja sasa kwa reality huko ndani yeah mm. so yes. kwa ufupi to see fake to see no fake be you mm. to see do you wewe. kama mm. unakulanga mkate mzima Una kama mimi kula <laughs> <laughs> tu <laughs> <laughs> lakini all that said and yes. done yes. There is a positive side yes. that marriage still works, works. Mm. and as long as jesus is the center of that marriage yes. Yes. Not that challenges will not be there. Challenges mm. will always be there. Yes. And marriage still works. Yeah, But yeah. these are challenges zikikuja. Yeah. Learn involve God mm. and let God direct you to the right people yes. ambao watawasaidia mm. to solve. Marriage is good and marriage is godly. Is not hiyo kitu ambao mtu alianzisha mm. ni Mungu mwenyewe ali. And it works. Marriage is good. Ah. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. So, parting mm. shot yako Barak Mimi what do we do kama mm. wenye tunaita watu watusaidie kuimba nini nini tunafaa kufanya your um, advice to them kwa watu wenye wanatusaidia eh? tusaidia tuko uko na gig uh-huh. umeita watu you, umeita watu we call people to help, you, to help you uh, yeah hakuna hakuna uh, kitu ya free yeah <laughs> kwa hii dunia tulipwe utaenda <laughs> studio <laughs> utalipa pesa yes au uh, utaenda dukani au mm. uh, utalipa na passion Uh-huh. Kuna wakati nilikuwa nimeenda audition mahali uh-huh. nikaulizwa um, are you ready to act for free I was acting in Facebook some time back uh-huh. and I was like yes by that time I just left high school yes so and the question you were be I, I was I I said I am ready uh-huh. I'm I'm ready to act for free yeah but the question I was asked was um why uh-huh. nikasema because I am passionate <laughs> and they asked me will you take passion and pay it as rent <laughs> <laughs> no, you no. take passion and pay it as, as rent. rent. So it is very very important mm. for us to appreciate even to appreciate ministers. Mungu yes. amekuja, mm. ametumia fare, yeah. amepiga luku kama wewe. Check it even now. See of free. Eh eh. 
si ujaenda kwa duka ukaomba nguo eh, ukarabashanda no. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have bought so everything. Done. They want a music minister who looks so good, good, well put together, but they don't want to pay. There is nothing like that. Mm. Let's appreciate the art mm. as much as we appreciate the anointing. Yes. Let's appreciate the work that goes behind every art. Yes, mm. Gloria. Mm. Ambia wachungaji kitu mm. na wahuduma. Wahuduma tukue sisi la kitu. Let, uh, let us... Be servants. Yes. Sikuwe maboss. Yes. Uh, first mm. wako asikuwe boss na wewe usikuwe boss kwa pasi. Mm-mm. Kama sijaimba hiyo crusade, uh, pasi ya utashika. Mm. Uh, so uh, let us compliment each other. Mm. Tuwache kushindana. Tuwache competition. Because hii kazi kona mwenyewe. Mm. Kona mwenyewe. Aneza amua leo afunge hiyo sauti. Sauti ya utaimba. Mm. Utaimba na utaongea. Mm. Well. Let us be servants. Mtumishi mm. wabwana shafin. Mm-hmm. Watumishi wa mungu mm. tu to appreciate what we have. Yes. Hakuna venye utaita guest singer mm. akuja alafu nampatia bahasha na wale watu wako wa nyumbani praise and worship ndio wanafanya kazi kubwa kwanza hata ndio wanamfanyia backup. Mm. Alafu nawaambia bwana akubariki, tembea mm. salama mm. na huyo praise and worship kwake ameacha kama mlango imefungwa yeah. ama ama hata hajui akitoka kwa hiyo mkutano mm. anaenda kukula nini. You might not pay these people because yes. you can't. The gift yeah. of God you cannot pay. Yes. But appreciating these people with something mm. it motivates them. We are not here to be motivated Mm-mm. because the Holy Spirit motivates us yeah. lakini tunahitaji pesa. Mm. Money. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah, Brother amemaliza mm. wanahitaji pesa. And mm. guys, it has been nice having mm. you here. Thank you. It has been a great discussion. Looking Thank forward you. to having another one like this. Thank you. Again and again, these are things we need to talk about. Yeah. And guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for being there. Thank you for the feedback which I know <laughs> yeah, I will come back kuwajibu ama nitaleta gloria tena wajibu. <laughs> so, mimi my parting shot ni pastors men of god please go back to being fathers mm-hmm. the way you guys were we can run to you and be safe and sisi wa huduma ama watoto can we go back to being children mm-hmm. yes. can we go back to being like listening to our fathers listen to counsel na mungu atatubariki na atatutenda wema amen this is music stories god of bless sana this is wema tv see you again next sunday god of bless Oh